Rising building costs and the inability to get permits in a timely manner are costing local homeowners big money. KITV4's Kristen Concilio reports why it's an urgent problem that still needs fixing. Peter Troy's waited more than six months for building permits to remodel a deteriorating home his family bought in August 2020. And according to builders, that's fast for the city's beleaguered Department of Planning and Permitting. The Troy's had planned to move into their new East Oahu home about a year ago, and the delays mean their budget is shrinking. So my property is idling while I had to pay rent and mortgage. So that is a heavy burden. Every month it's going to be like over 10 plus thousand. I'm, I'm, I'm depleting my bank account. Meanwhile, building costs are skyrocketing. Most of our reserve is gone. And a lot of stuff we need to do, we have to hold back. You know, like landscaping, rain gutter. We, we don't have enough money to do it anymore. There's a current backlog of more than 3,200 building permit applications, according to DPP. A spokesman says people are waiting on average four to five months. But contractors say it's actually much longer. Atlas Construction has 28 applications in the pipeline. The contractor does almost 60 projects a year and says building costs are escalating at about 6% by the time permits are issued. About nine months is what we're averaging on our building permits. They're operating at 30% capacity, and it's just because there's been a big overturn uh, uh, attrition rate in that position. Delays in processing have been a problem for years. The department came under scrutiny last year when six people were charged with taking bribes to expedite permits. The city's in the process of overhauling the building permit application system by the end of the year. In the meantime, DPP Director Dean Uchida told KITV in a statement, the department is still trying to figure out how to improve processing times as contractors continue to wait. Kristen Concilio, KITV4 Island News.